Okay guys, this is the third take on this video. I just did a 20 minute video and my phone ran out of space. So I'm going to do this really fast because this is getting annoying and I seriously just start rambling and it gets awkward. So just like I am right now. Anyways, I'm just going to go through this really fast just to show you guys what I'm doing. Okay. Let me show you. Okay, I'm going to start with Eli. So... Keep in mind, you are propped in a box, and my water bottle is holding up my phone. So, that's how legit this video is. Anyways, so, for Eli, for his kindergarten, Kira's in first grade, going in first grade. So, I went with the um, Abeka number skills, K5. The reason why I'm switching from Singapore to Abeka is just because I did Abeka with Kira, it's really hard to show you guys. I did a back with Kira and it was totally fine. It just gets a little bit repetitive. Re eh, repetitive. So, and with Kira, I would, would not skip any lessons, even if she was frustrated. I am the, I was, was the type that would just push on, like, come on, we gotta finish, we gotta finish every lesson, we just gotta do this. I'm not gonna do that because it's okay. You can take a chill pill. So, Becca. And then we're also doing letters and sounds through and back out with Eli. So kindergarten, I just wanted to have fun. Yeah, I just wanted to have fun right now. Obviously, I wanted to learn. That's why I got all this. But I wanted to have fun. Um, when I ordered my um, The Good and the Beautiful and the Singapore Math, uh, which I think was back in um, June, which they're already almost done with. Um, Kira's almost done with hers. Uh, language arts and literature and Eli finished his um, pre-k primer which was amazing we loved it so I purchased this at the same time too and he just wasn't ready for it this is the level one handwriting with the good and the beautiful and he may or may not like this one I'm sure he will so I honestly forgot I had it on my shelf because um, I just set it aside because he wasn't ready for it so we have that just in case but I did get him a reason for handwriting um, I've never used this before. Sorry, guys. This one's an awkward one because it opens like that. So, reason for handwriting. Um, now, this is just something I threw in that would be fun for him. Kira and Eli have the same one. It's it is kinder uh, first grade because um, the kindergarten just didn't look like enough for Eli. It was already stuff he had already he, he already knew. So we're not going to start off right off the bat because it's, it, it's addition and he hasn't quite gotten to that yet. I mean, they explained it a little bit, but I, it's not in his curriculum just yet. So, and then I got the DK books for geography. Um, uh, um, Eli has kindergarten, cares his first grade. So this is going to be going along with um, some other things as well. So that's not like the main one. And then this one also is just something fun. They both have the same one. It's Kulan, um, Pre-K and Up, Geography, U.S. and Canada. So they are going to be putting stickers where the stickers go. And it just gives you some little facts right here. Just a simple little book that I hope they have fun with because there's stickers. What child does not like stickers? I was more bubbly in the last two videos I just tried to take. Okay, so this one, I thought I got two, but I guess I only got one. I wish I got two. But anyways, this one looks super fun. It's really simple. Um, and what I just opened the book and read was the fact that you can, the whole point is to basically get like a big cardboard that your child would fit on and trace their body in it, cut it out. I don't know where we're going to stick it. Put it on a wall maybe in the hall? nice but anyways then you're going to learn about your body part whoop not those body parts um like for instance your heart how much to send your kidney beans <laughs> because Kira opened the book it's like uh, a couple hours ago and she's like these are called your kidney beans and like well they're called your kidneys but yeah okay anyways so yeah and then you cut them out color them and then you can glue them tape them on your little person that you cut out of your child right super cute <clears throat> okay moving on to Kira where do I begin with Kira's um 
So Kira is right now finishing up her handwriting level two with The Good and the Beautiful. This is level three. She was extremely, extremely excited um, when she saw this in the box. She loves, loves, loves this. So now, if anyone is asking me, which I have had a couple people do, um, the because of what we call it, the good and the beautiful is Jenny Phillips is Mormon. There is nothing Mormon in these curriculums, but I have only purchased the language arts literature and the handwriting, which I have not noticed anything to do with their um, uh, religion. So, okay, now. For Kira's language, arts, and literature, she is currently, like I said, finishing up with the Good and the Beautiful level, ki the kindergarten level. She's almost done with that. But I was so torn between two um, curriculums for language, arts, and literature. Obviously, I'm obsessed with master books, so I, I had to get their um, language lessons for living education that came out a little bit ago. Yay! Oh my goodness, you guys. You have no idea how excited I am over this right here because it's Master Books. Oh, it's so good. I'm so excited. So, but anyways, language arts and literature, Master Books, and The Good and the Beautiful. I wanted to continue with The Good and the Beautiful because it's more advanced. Um, but also try this one as well. So I'm, I haven't really thought about the fact of how I'm going to work these in on a daily basis. Like, am I gonna do one one day and do this in the next day? I don't really know. I haven't really thought about that all too much, but we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Okay, wow, this is amazing. It's a seven minute video. <laughs> when I got to this point in the other video, I was at like 15 minutes. Okay, now. Master Books again, my story and the world around me. I'm so excited, so excited for this book. Now, it is time to, it says time to explore social studies while journeying across the earth on four quests. That's too close. Let me do that again. This is hard work. Like, do -do -do. this box is not cutting it. I love it, you guys. Okay, so Eli is going to be doing this with us, as in he's going to be listening. Um, now, the write-in stuff, this is Kira's book, but I want him to be there when we're reading it so he can hear it as well. So, Kira is finishing up Master Books, Math Lesson for Living Education Level 1. This is the next step up. We've had this because I won it last year from Rebecca Spooner. I love her, by the way. If you don't know her, go find her. Her Instagram and her Facebook name is Homeschool On. Go find her, guys. She's amazing. Okay, so Master Books, The Good and the Beautiful, Abeka, and some random stuff. So um, this is another just fun stuff. They love the Kira. <laughs> Kira literally goes in her room, like this morning, I, I was cleaning like crazy this morning because we had to have maintenance come in here and do some stuff. So I wanted it to be clean in here, so I was busy cleaning, and I went in her room and she was doing math, like, because I have a ton of these random dollar store little booklets, um, and she was just doing math. I was like, oh, okay, that's awesome. So I went ahead and got some fun ones. So this is the same one as Eli. Um, darn. Oh, I thought my... Oh, I thought it went off. Sorry. It's so dramatic. I was like, darn. Anyways, these on ChristianBook.com are only $1.99. And there's like 30 pages of, um, no, excuse me, it's not 30, it's 39, 39 pages for $2.99. So this is called the Smart Alex series. Let's do something fun. And then Beginner Geography by Evan Moore. Kindergarten to two, second to two grade, to second grade. And it comes with these little map thingies. Um, kind of a little overkill with geography. 
point out. They were actually really cute guys on ChristianBook.com. And then another geography. Eli has this one, but in kindergarten, the DK books. I just thought this one would be super easy to fly through, but also really informative. And there's the same one as Eli Geography. Uh, Kumon, same thing. Okay, so that's that. Um, I'm just waiting on, I have to order my Science for Master books. They just came out with it. I'm really excited, you guys. Oh my goodness, it looks so good. Um, but it's not out till the end of this month, end of August. So I'll be getting that. And then also Not Grass History. I am so excited to try that history. Um, it looks amazing. If you haven't heard of it, go check them out. Um, one last thing. Um, Bob Books. I did not buy these, you guys. Anyways, um, yeah, so anyways, the kids love these. No, neither of them are using the K, the kindergarten one, yet. But Eli is using the, um, the kindergarten and first grade one. So, no, 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 no. Excuse me. I'm wrong. This is Kira. Kira's using this one. She's six. Eli's using the pre-K. I was going to say, wait a minute, he's using the K through one, but he's not using the K. Hmm. Yeah, but these are so cute, you guys. So cute. So fun. So colorful. Um, and they go along with the Bob, the actual Bob books. So if you haven't seen these, check them out. Um, these are just supplemental that the kids can do if they want to. Like today, they were begging me to do them, so we did them. Um, because Eli has no more school at the moment. Um, until we start up, which I haven't really figured out exactly the start date on when we're starting our new curriculum because I still have to wait for my order. Uh, probably It'll probably get here sometime in September, I want to say. So I'm sorry if you can hear the fan in our bathroom going. I just put the kids down and we run the fan when they sleep just so it can kind of, they don't have to hear me doing dishes and whatnot. So, <sighs> okay. It's a 12 minute video, the other one was 20 minutes. I don't even know how long they, nine minutes, yeah. Okay, I made it you guys, I did it. I did it. Yeah, so this is what we're doing. That's a lot of stuff. Well, not necessarily. Here we go. Oi. There. My babies. <laughs> All right guys, Um. yeah. That's all. Once I get the other stuff, I will show you guys. But for now, this is it. But we're not starting, obviously. Uh, bye, guys. Thanks for listening to my awkwardness. <laughs>